defying death. Tech saves skydiver's life after he was knocked out mid-air. Two skydivers jumped from a plane and crashed mid-air at Summerfest Skydiving Festival at the Skydive Chicago Resort in Ottawa. CBS2 reported on the death-defying clash. The two seasoned skydivers collided around 11 a.m. on Tuesday morning, resulting in one of them, 81-year-old Bill Morrissey, being knocked unconscious. Motionless Morrissey was falling fast toward the earth, but fortunately for him, he was donning an automated activation device inside a parachute pack. What's an automated activation device, you ask? Anthony Ebel of Skydive Chicago says it best. Essentially, it's just a device that measures how fast the person is falling and what altitude they're at. Once they hit a certain threshold, it then starts the deployment process of the reserve parachute. The life-saving device opened his chute, bringing him gently back to Earth alive and still kicking. U.S. News stated that as he was unable to steer, he landed in the Fox River. Both jumpers were taken to OSF St. Elizabeth Medical Center and miraculously both were fine, barring minor injuries. Matt Morrissey, who has jumped more than 7,000 times spanning 62 years, said, I wear an automated activation device because that's what common sense tells you to do. More like measured Morrissey then.